What's up guys, you already know about the Mino Monsters app due to my previous app review. Um, it's a little update. Uh, first of all, this is their website, of course. MinoMonsters.com You can go ahead and check that out. Um, it's a young website. Um, it's new. The only thing I'm wondering about is you see this little purple thing right here? I don't know where that is in the game. So maybe that's Amino they haven't added yet. But uh, really what this uh, video is about is I recently, and by recently I mean today, contacted them with a list of about five questions. And wouldn't you know, I believe his name's Jake, no, Josh Buckley, uh, he responded. Um, his response was, Hey, Michael, thanks for the support. I sent him pretty much telling them, you know, how amazing the app is and the artwork is phenomenal and everything. And so I gave him five questions. And basically what they did was reinstate the question and then give an answer. So question one um, is, will you raise the level cap above 20? All my Minos are level 20 and they don't level any further. Their response was, yep. An awesome update will be out at the end of January with new Minos and higher levels. So, it's a little far away, but hey, it gives you all enough time to catch up and get to level 20 with all your guys. That way we're all on the same um, playing field when it comes out. Question two. Will you add more Bible Minos? For sure. Except, expect these in early 2012. So again, a month away. Uh, will you add more questing areas? Again, they said, yep, at the end of January. Question four, are evolutions in your thoughts for this game? Because I believe that would attract a bunch of people here to this game. Their response, we are considering it. Although, don't expect evolutions anytime soon. We don't have enough people on the team to manage it, but we are hearing that people want it a lot. Um, you know, since they're a new, con a new, <laughs> they're a new uh, gaming company, you know, they still got to build management and everything, so that's completely understandable. Um, you know, I'm not in any hurry to get head over heels into a new game, so I can wait. Um, and finally, five, is it possible that you make PvP outside of Facebook? My concern on this is because I don't have a lot of people on Facebook who are into the type of gaming that I play, or that I do. I can't PvP with anyone, so maybe if you could add a function where we could create a profile for ourselves and then there could be a list of all other players in this game and we could fight that way you know basically like pocket summoner you know since my video channel is about pocket summoner we have it more like that uh... these are just a few questions ideas and concerns of mine i hope you have read this and i hope to hear back from you their response is we'll definitely add pvp outside of facebook in the new year um, so yeah, I'm I'm excited that they responded uh fairly quickly. Um it excites me because you get so used to how Pocket Summoner is and you know, like three, four days later for a crappy response and I believe since they're a new company and everything, I think they're gonna live up to it. But uh yeah, that's just basically for the people who play. Uh I know there's a lot of questions that were asked, um and like the app review and all that. So I just went ahead and took those questions out and hit them up myself um, so yeah if you want to go ahead and check out the website even though there's not much to it so they really you wouldn't be seeing much but it's minomonsters.com uh, thank you guys for watching and have a great day